was that story you were you were sharing with me about the poor lady that was kicked out of the the Sabbath house for oh. alcohol, and then she was attacked and killed. Yeah, what was publicized was that she. Uh, it's like about a couple of years ago. This this woman that had regularly been attending the yeah. Sabbath house went back at the usual time, you know, like four o'clock, and they said, uh, "Sorry, you're you know you're under the influence of alcohol. We can't let you. Uh, we can't let you." Uh, Come in here. She walked away from there because she was not allowed to go in there, only because of her intoxication. There was no room. There's no other room. There's no alternative provided to her. And he said, "We're sorry." So, well, she left, and she was attacked. She was attacked only about a half a block away, on her way downtown here. Probably just stayed in the park or something. She was killed. She was killed. The next day, they found her with. Uh, lacerations to her head and uh, the talk on the street was she was attacked by maybe gang members or something mm -hmm. someone preying on on uh, you know uh, helpless women as, as part of their initiation possibly you know but they, they were pretty sure that she had been hit like with baseball bats and stuff sure. so and that's only because we don't have a program to uh, address Oh, right now in Chico, it's it's a uh, if you're intoxicated, you just better go hide somewhere, because we don't have a place for you, an official place mm -hmm. for you. You know, a lot of people I talk to, men that are jump, that's a common theme. They're drunk. Yeah. You, and you know you, that you, the people prey on the drunks because they're yeah. easy prey. You had some good ideas about trying to kind of get people more active, chaperones and some other ideas. What would start uh, forming uh, self forming. Uh, 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 groups that will that will uh, uh, just announce themselves with a badge or something. Hey, I'm available, you know, to take someone home if they're if they're drunk or or to be with them if they've been uh, uh, not accepted into uh, a shelter situation right. or hey, if they're just a college student wanting to go from one location to another and there's no one to go with them. Posted in the places they go to will right. be. Hey, we're an organization that's for you. Keep us in your wallet if you need. If you don't, you know, if you're not comfortable about going anywhere, and we'll escort or chaperone whatever you, you're wanting. We're not paid to do it, so and that'd be it's something you'd be interested in volunteering to do. Oh, myself, yeah. Awesome, you know, Steve. It, it'd give me, it'd give me, you know, give me five, man. It was <laughs> awesome.